Welcome back to IT and to Scratch. You saw in earlier lessons how to make the baddies and the power pills. And now we're going to be making a different type of power pill and a different type of situation. This time we're going to make it when we reach a certain score. So if I press stop, press play, press stop again, and I can move this guy over here. We've got naught score, hit points, I've got three things to mind. We've also got two baddies. Now, I want to make a different type of power pill, so I'm going to need a new sprite. Now, I'm going to see if I can find the life form from the file. I'm going to go up because I don't want any dragons. I want stuff. And I think we're going to have fortune cookie. I like the idea of a fortune cookie. Now, I don't like the idea of a giant fortune cookie, so I'm going to shrink my sprites again. And, yeah, is that right? And I'm going to shift it to about here. Now, I'm going to make the script on here, so the control and when this is clicked, the first thing I want to do is make it hide. Sorry about that. I want it hidden because I want only want it to appear once those three have been munched. So how am I going to do this? First of all, let's go back to our control. I want when I receive we want new a message name is is going to be show cookie now we're going to show cookie when score which is on the sprites is equal to three so after this has been clicked Forever if variables and as that won't fit, doesn't fit, no good. Let's go to sensing. We need and we need some kind of sensor thing that's going to fit in there. So what we need is this one operators now this is quite interesting because it allows us to put into um, the area into our forever if statement a reference to another variable so forever if Score equals three. What we want to do back to control, we need to broadcast show cookie. So let's see if this works. Certainly hidden the cookie, all right. Oh. What's gone wrong here? Let's go back to our sprite. When I receive show cookie, we haven't told it to, to do anything. Let's go back to looks. Let's go. Show. So let's start green. Let's scratch again. Let's see if we can get this to show. See it showed there. Stop. I press play again. That hasn't hidden. Oh dear. Let's see if we can do do something for sort first. You see here. That's when I receive show cookie. And we've told it to do it when it's 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 reset to. And um, the score is set at three. 
It's good gone down. But let's see if there is something else. I reckon duplicate that and put it on there. Duplicate that. Put it on there. It might work. See, it's disappeared. Two. There we go. So we know that that's working. So go back to the sprite. Told it to show. We haven't told it anything else. The bit we needed to tell it to is here. So what we need to do, duplicate that, drop it onto our sprite, fix that, go back into sprite 7, and then stick that together. Now instead of changing it by 1, let's change it by 5. And so, what we've learned here is by changing, is by adding a new broadcast when we get to a new score we can make this new um, this new sprite appear and then add to our score so we can do things with that and that is how you add in extra high scoring things which only appear after something in particular has happened